Okay, this is the Tampa Bay Wallpaper Installer coming to you from Tampa, Florida. And what we're doing is a uh, commercial vinyl installation, 53, 54 inch wide vinyl. And uh, this particular installation is one in which the vinyl will be going over vinyl. Now, what happens when you wrinkle the wallpaper? You open the wallpaper up, it's as perfect as the manufacturer sends it out, but on, on, over the course of unraveling the wallpaper, you put a crease in it, which is common with 54 inch, over 50 inch wallpaper. I mean, after all, it runs the span of an average person's arm span, left hand to right hand, when it's completely spread out. And so therefore, it's difficult to manage. It becomes cumbersome. And so don't panic if you put a wrinkle in your wall covering, because I'm gonna show you how to get it out. Now, I'm gonna to try to show you the wrinkle in this. I'm gonna give you a couple of angles, okay? You just keep your eye on where I put the finger. Okay, here's where the wrinkle is. I'm sure you, I can see it now on the camera. Okay, see how that wrinkle is? So it's actually, it almost feels like a braided, feels like it's, there's something under there, you know? Almost like a wire brush. It's that thick and that hard. So now you could say, well, that's damaged, right? Well, let's see. Now you see how, you see how it is. I'm not gonna edit this video. I'm gonna show you how we're gonna get that out and it's very simple. If you thought about heat, you were right. And that's what we're gonna to use to get this out. So here's, here's our wrinkle. And I'm just going to use uh, a heat gun to apply heat in and around the area, constantly moving it so it doesn't get too hot to get this out. Let's see how I do. I wanna feel the area so it doesn't get too hot. The reason why it got wrinkled is because of heat. What do you think happened when I bent the plastic, the vinyl in it? It got so hot. You know when you take, um, you get Chinese food and it comes in those white containers? And if you've ever been bored before, you take the lid and you bend it, and you see the white marks that came because of the creases in it? Well, that's because of molecular acceleration in the in the plastic and that's the the result of the heat heating up that plastic and quickly cooling off and then the result is a bend in it and the white color and the result of bending the wall covering vinyl mostly vinyl is the same effect except you don't have the discoloration now, I'm not trying to trick you. I, my, my wrinkle's already out. I'm not trying to distract you. I'm just talking to you while I get this thing out. And I want to show you now the result. There's a little bit of the wrinkle still left in it, so you can see how easy this comes out. Watch this. Look at this. Hold on a second. Let me put the heat gun down. And I'm going to show you the whole thing from the below all the way up. Okay? Now, where was my wrinkle? Here it was. Do you still see the little effects of the wrinkle right there? Okay. I see them. I'm sure you can too. Okay. But I'll tell you right now, even if I left it right then and there, we're good. You know what I'm saying? But not me. I'm a perfectionist. So let's, let's complete it. Okay. Here was my wrinkle. Now, who taught me this? Nobody. Nobody told me this. You just realized that if, if the vinyl creased, it's got to come out with the same type of thing that put it in, and that is heat. If you heat it up too much, you got to tear it down and throw it out. So you want to constantly be moving that thing and feeling it. If your skin can touch it, it's not too hot. Unless you suffer from numbness or something, then <laughs> you might want to use a body body that can feel it. I'm only kidding. Okay, we're good. All right, I'm going to show you now the result of our repair. Our repair is right here, okay? And we're good.
And you can see, look at the stretching that the heat does. That's a, that, this wrinkle here is caused by the heat. And what you're doing when you put a wrinkle in it is you're, 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 um, you're stretching, you're softening the material. It, it makes it more manageable or pliable or malleable. And you just spread that out. And you, you left, you, your end result is a smooth surface. Okay. And there you have it. This is Spencer, the Tampa Bay Wallpaper Installer, coming to you from Tampa, Florida. If you thought this tip was useful, click on like, subscribe to my channel, and share it with a friend. If you have another way of doing it, do me a favor. Put it down in the comments section. I want to hear how you get your wrinkles out of your vinyl installations. Okay, see you on the next one. Thank you.